Hello guys and girls, welcome back to the Racing Line for another circuit guide here on iRacing. This is week two of season two, 2021 in the Simlab Production Car Challenge and we are on board with Stephen King driving the Volkswagen Jetta TDI Cup car. This week's circuit is Lime Rock Park, the Grand Prix layout, that is the one with the chicane and the date and time is set to the 1st of April 2021 at 8.50 in the morning to match the official race time sent out on the season two PDF. All circuit guides are run with baseline car setups, but since you can use setups in the SimLab Challenge, the laps you see may be low fuel quali runs. Same format as before, a breakdown lap followed by a full speed uninterrupted lap followed by an offboard lap. And as usual, this is filmed before the week has begun, so it's difficult to compare lap times. But let's see if we can help you guys find some time. But before we get started, let's have a quick shout out to the Volkswagen Jetta Cup schedule on this channel every Monday night at 20 past 8. You should be making sure you're tuning into this. We've missed round one already. Round two is round Lime Rock. It mirrors the SimLab Challenge. If you want to see what you're in for for the SimLab Challenge for the following week, make sure you tune in this Monday at 20 past 8. Now let's get started. First braking zone for the right-hander of turn one, the number two board. Hard on the brakes. This is kind of a double apex corner, so we're going to do this slightly slow motion. Hard on the brakes from sixth to fifth, aiming for the first apex, and then get back on the throttle a little bit out to the middle of the track. As you get to the middle, downshift to fourth to get the turn in for that second apex. You should be then flat out on the exit. Look for the telephone pole on the right-hand side. That first one is when we're going to start turning in towards turn two. And then we're going to have a quick short stab of the brakes just before the little dirt patch on the left ends to get a bit more turning. We want to be hugging this white line all the way round. Again, mid-corner, let's downshift to fourth to get that extra turn in. Stay on this curb. It's crucial that you're on the left-hand side on the exit of this corner as it really opens up this right-hander as we upshift to fifth as we turn in towards the apex. But you will notice that it is flat out. You don't want to be lifting through there. As long as you get your line right, it should be easy flat through the right-hander. Make sure you're on the left on the exit of turn two. Next braking zone, the big tree on the left-hand side, ever so slightly before it, from fifth down into third gear. Really hard on the brakes here in a straight line. Get it chucked in in third. As soon as you hit this first apex is when you're going to start accelerating and get straight back up into fourth. You can mount the second curve, but then avoid the two on the right-hand side. You don't want to be bouncing all over them. But make sure you go up into fourth straight away. You're only using third for the turn in. No braking here, just a slight lift down to around 25% throttle. You can use the curve on the entry and the exit if you need to. Try not to though. And then again, just a slight lift for this final corner, maybe about 50%, between 50 and 70% throttle through there. You should be able to carry a lot of speed through that final corner and then it's a nice run down to the line and across the line for a one minute point zero lap time around lime rock park so here we go full speed uninterrupted looking for the number two board hard on the brakes down to fifth hit the first apex accelerate out to the middle down to fourth to get that extra turn in hit the second apex and we should be flat out now on the exit look for the telephone pole on the right start turning in Short stab of the brake, still in fifth, down to fourth to get the extra turn in. Hug the left-hand side, and now it's flat out all the way through here as we go up into fifth on the apex point of that right-hander. Down this little straight now, quite hard to overtake round here. Left-hand side, looking for the tree, hard on the brakes, fifth, down to third. Get it chucked in, straight up into fourth and accelerate through the uphill section, being careful of those curbs all over the place. Stick to the left-hand side now. We're going to lift off to around 25%, get it turned in, back on the throttle relatively quickly using all the track on the exit be careful of the grass and again a small lift 70 to 50 percent there it is get it turned in watch that grass on the exit if you touch that two wheels you're going left into the wall or you're spinning right into the oncoming traffic and there is a lap of lime rock park grand prix as usual that is pretty much it from me so i'm going to leave you with this offboard lap don't forget to keep those likes and comments coming in and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and of course, don't forget to tune in Monday night, 20 past 8 for the next 12 weeks or 11 weeks left now of the Volkswagen Jetta Cup. And if I don't see you on track this week, then I'll see you next week for the next video here on The Racing Line. Peace.